How difficult is a coding bootcamp? Hi, my name is David. I just finished my second month of coding bootcamp at UC Berkeley Coding Bootcamp Online. And in this video, I want to talk to you about how difficult a coding bootcamp actually is. You know, all my life, I've been told how smart I am. I've been complimented about how hardworking I am. People have been impressed by all the things I'm able to accomplish. But taking this bootcamp has definitely been a humbling experience. At times, it feels like I'm not as smart as I thought I was. Comparing it to college, because in college, I feel like you're only working two times during the entire semester, during midterm weeks and finals week, where you're really cramming yourself so you can pass the exams. The rest of the month, the semester, you're kind of just procrastinating along, pretending like you're doing work. During this coding bootcamp, it feels like every week is a midterm and finals week. You really have to be on point because when the instructors are teaching these concepts, if you miss one idea, one statement, it can ruin your understanding of the big picture. And it's funny because the instructors will ask, does anyone have any questions? And I'll be like, yeah, I have a question about this. And they'll say, what part don't you understand? And in my mind, I'm thinking all of it. So it's tough understanding all the concepts of how it's all connected. And we have two homework assignments usually every week. And these homework assignments are hard. And I find myself having to ask my classmates all the time for help, asking them, hey, can you help explain me this? Sometimes we'll have study groups to help each other on the homework and we'll talk about it, exchange ideas. And I always find myself so far behind and everyone else is so far ahead in, in that specific homework assignment that I'm asking, hey, how did you do this? Can you help me explain that? And it feels like I'm not the one helping others as much as they are the ones helping me. And the thing with coding is that you can get by coding without fully understanding it. You can write some line of code and magically it makes your application work. But every time you have to write code without fully understanding it, you kind of feel like an imposter. You feel bad about yourself and it's tough having that feeling. And I understand that no one understands everything about all the code lines in an application. But it's always worrisome when you have to write a code and you don't really understand what is going on. And lastly, another thing that's difficult about this coding bootcamp, and it's easier for me but than other people, but it's doing projects. The instructors give you a project and you really have to start from scratch. You really have to be creative about choosing which projects you want to do, which is definitely hard because for the homework assignments, they kind of give you what to do and you just follow the instructions. But in projects, you have complete flexibility and creativity to do whatever you want. And you have to work in a team. And it's difficult working at teams at times because you have to express how you feel. You have to do disagreements. There's going to be conflicts and you have to be able to handle it. And I know that is difficult for a lot of people. It wasn't as difficult as me than other people because mainly because I think I've done so many things. I have so many broad experiences. I've talked to so many people. I worked in so many industries that it helped my creativity and working in teams. I think I messed up so many previous team projects in my past that I'm able to learn from it and work be better at working in teams. But I know that that could be a lot difficult for other people taking the bootcamp is how to work on a project on a team and creating an idea from nothing and making it happen. So taking a bootcamp is really difficult. It feels like you're kind of drowning and it's hard for you to get by. You really have to be on point when learning things and need repetition on it. And sometimes you just find yourself comparing yourself to other people, but you really just have to focus on the progress you made. So that's all I want to share with you in this video. Thank you for listening.